the evil practices of apartheid in South Africa began in the churches of South Africa. As black members were excluded from worshiping and gathering at the same communion table with white members of the church. The evil practice of apartheid and the violence and injustices that it supported began in the church. The Belhar Confession was written during this time as a protest to the sin of apartheid. In 2016, the Presbyterian Church USA overwhelmingly voted to include the Belhar Confession in our Book of Confessions as a statement of what we believe, what we confess as followers of Christ, and our commitment as a church to stand against racism, injustice, and do the work of reconciliation, building a world where all God's children might flourish. Our confession today comes from the Belhar Confession. This we believe. God longs to bring justice and peace among all people. This we believe. In a world of injustice, hate, and division, God is in a special way the God of the destitute, the poor, and the wronged. This we believe. God calls the church to stand where Jesus stands, to stand against injustice, to stand with those who are wronged. This we believe. God teaches the church to do what is good, to seek what is right. This we believe. It is the church's work to reject all forms of injustice in ourselves and amongst us and to struggle against every teaching that allows injustices to flourish. This we believe. God sees a day when all people, black, white, red, yellow, brown, when all people live together in harmony. This we believe. God has called us to the holy work of making that dream a reality. This we believe. God calls the church to follow Jesus, to lift up the poor, to heal those who hurt, to feed those who hunger, to comfort those who grieve. This we confess today. We fall short of being the people who God created us to be. We fall short of being the church God calls us to be. We fall short of building the world where all live in harmony that God dreams of and that God intends. And this we know. We are forgiven. And we are forgiven again and again. And we are loved. And we belong to God and in belonging to God, we belong to one another. This we know. We are given the spirit of peace that we might be the makers of peace. May it be so.